Randall should be the one laying there. Not your brother. I'm not leaving you behind. You start butchering their people, and our chances of making it out of here, any of us, go down to zero. They, they had some supplies just sitting out, and Norma caught me. I didn't think she was going to, but she, she, she let me go. Michonne, what is it? I hope you're not thinking about jumping. Because if you do, I'm gonna have to come in after you. I'm not looking forward to that. Water's gonna be an ice bath. No one wants to see that, Oak. Yeah, I know. Ooh, freezing my ass off. Yeah. Coffee will warm you up. Go on. You'll be glad you did. <coughs> God damn, Oak. You can't call it coffee when more than half's whiskey. Uh, you sound like my ex-wife. She was more of a rum girl. Despised a lot of them when I first got on board, but they grow on you. Like mole, they are. Nah, nah, sorry, that shit, isn't it? They're growing on me, too. Kind of nice that people can still joke around. It's a fine line between the court jester and the village idiot. You can guess which side I think he's on. Before I joined up with Pete, my brother and I were cooped up in an old canning factory. Food for ages. A lot of fat and happy people. But then, a young girl got taken. We followed a trail. It wasn't hard with all the blood. Ended up cornering the people who took her in this warehouse. All ten of us went in. Only I came out. You did the right thing. And it got my brother killed. The right thing can kiss my ass. A few weeks later, I came across Pete. Ways up the coast. He saw that look on my face and he... Offered me a job. Didn't ask any questions. Didn't turn me away. Just welcomed me in. Pete's a good goddamn egg in a rotten world. 
I don't always get Pete, but I'm glad people like him still exist. I'll drink to that. Well, I think Berto's little routine is winding down, so we can finally play cards. Care to join us? It'd be nice to have you there. Besides, none of us can remember the rules. So, it'd be the most, uh, unique game of Go Fish you've ever played. Yeah. Do me in. Sounds like a challenge. You might regret it when I win that machete of yours. Oh, God. He's dead. I should have stopped you. How could you do this? That man was tied up. Defenseless. You're better than this. I'm sorry, Pete. I... I couldn't control myself. I can see that. I wanted this. I, I did, but seeing him now... I wish I'd been the one to do it. Sam. It was my dad. My family. I should have killed Randall myself. You're not a killer, Sam. Don't become one. You don't know what I am. Uh! Sam, calm down. My dad isn't even in the fucking ground yet, and you want me to calm down? I, I didn't mean... He ruined everything. He killed... I know, I know. You don't know. Wait. You hear that? Answer me. Now. Michonne? You don't want to keep me waiting. I'm right here. Good. You might be sitting pretty thinking you have the upper hand, but your luck has changed. Michelle and Sadiq. They got the rest of the crew too. Oak and Berto. Look, whatever this bitch asks, don't... Sadiq! Don't worry. They're all in good hands here. But them staying that way is up to you. So listen closely. I'm willing to trade my brother for your friends. But anything you do to Randall, I will do to them. Do you understand? Look, you don't owe me anything, but please... We have to get them back. That's my deal, Michonne. Just do what she says. That goes both ways. Anything you do to my friends, I'll do to Randall. You better not touch him! We'll be there by sunrise. Be ready for us. She's coming here for her brother, when she sees what we do to him. At least he can walk, right? 
If you can call that walking. Let's just hope she doesn't take it out on my guys. Norma wants her brother. It's not like there's another option here. The bag helps. A little. She's gonna want to see his face. Maybe we can stall her. And then what? Norma's not gonna leave us alone. She won't stop just because we gave her her brother back. Even if he was alive, we still burned all their shit. So we run. After you trade for your friends, we haul ass to the back gate and get the hell out of here. But she'd take the house. Let her have it. Wouldn't she expect us to run? So what? She knows where we are now. Hiding isn't an option. So let's just go. Stop. Where do you propose we go? I don't know. Does it matter? Anywhere would be better than here. I can't fucking listen to this. <laughs> what? Sam, come back here. Sam! Sam, stop. You're going to hurt yourself. God damn it. Sam, stop. Maybe you're all ready to walk away, but I'm not just going to leave him like this. We couldn't give my mom a real funeral. My dad and I... I had to bury her here. Just the two of us. He'd want to be with her. That's all I can give him. I understand. He should be buried with your mom. But we can't focus on that right now. We have to be ready to leave. I'm not going. What? Sam, you can't still be thinking My that... mom is here, Paige. Everything I have of her. And Greg. If you want to leave, go ahead, but I'm not coming with you. <laughs> I'm sorry. But I, I can't go. This house meant everything to my dad. It's all I have left. I won't force you to leave. If you want to stay, that's up to you. You don't have to leave either. We can defend this house. We can fight them off. No matter what happens, thank you. I owe you my life. Sorry it took me so long to say it. I know it's stupid, but I have to finish this. I've got some weapons stashed in my room. Old duffel bag. Should look familiar. You should make sure everyone's armed before Norma gets here. Yeah. I, I was just wanted to know what it felt like. I, I wasn't going to shoot it. Just careful. You don't want to shoot yourself.
empty. Can I help? I want to do something. Sure, go ahead. Those slide in there. Round side forward. How could they just die like that? Greg and Dad. I, I thought we were safe here. What am I supposed to do? Everyone gets scared sometimes. I'm not afraid. <laughs> the guy who did it killed my dad. He's gotta, I mean, the things he said, the way he was laughing about dad, he can't get away with it. Randall is dead, James. I killed him. I heard you guys talking. There's more people coming to the house. Sam's hurt. If, if she, they can't hurt her too. You have to stop them. Your sister will be with me. I'll make sure she's safe. Here. I, I don't know if I'm ready, you know, to have one. She didn't always come to this. Janie, Rich, what's the holdup? Prisoners aren't cooperating. What do you want to do? Yeah, we don't have time for this. Get them moving. Is that music? I can't reach you. I like that. It's pretty. My dad gave it to me, so I wouldn't have to hear the things out there. As long as I stay in my fortress, I'm safe. It keeps all the bad stuff out. I put pillows and blankets against the wall. Was this your dad's idea? Yeah. My dad makes sure I'm always safe, so nothing can happen to me, ever. Especially not those things. I know what those monsters out there are. One to go. Grandma told me about them. It's what happens when someone eats another person. Oh? I hadn't heard that one before. Do they scare you too? They make lots of noise. Even at night. Getting scared is normal. Really? Happens to everyone sometimes. But my dad's not scared of them. I've been waiting for him. Where is he? Why didn't he come get me yet? Where is my dad? I'm 
so sorry, Alex. Something terrible happened. A bad man came and hurt your dad. What? He shot him. No, I don't believe you. I want to see him. Please. Did my dad be become one of them? It it it's what happens, right? He did, didn't he? No, your dad didn't become one of them. <laughs> He's still your dad. It's not fair. It's going to be okay, Alex. I promise. Your sister, James, they'll look out for you. Two and three checked in. Coming up on the road now. Hey, keep the chatter to a minimum. Our friends are listening. <laughs> Oh, hey, I, I didn't hear you come in. Here. Here, Pete. Thanks. You found the bag? Yeah, here. Thanks. Are the others ready? As ready as we're gonna get. I'm looking for Alex. Have you seen him? I want him to be there when I say a few words for Dad. He wasn't at Mom's funeral. He should be there for this. Alex asked about his father. So... I told him what happened. Oh, shit. I, uh, I should check on him then. You'll find him in his fortress. I'll meet you outside. Sam, you okay? Greg and Dad, I just, I don't really know what to say. Where am 
am I supposed to start? I don't know. Just say what he meant to you. Yeah. Okay. I'll give you a moment. Hey, you okay? Michonne. Just thinking about my kids. I keep seeing them. Hang in there. We'll be back out on the water soon. You know I envy them a little. They've managed to hold on to something we all lost a long time ago. Something like normal. I don't know how to describe it. Feels like before. Just a little bit. Sound like an idiot, don't I? Your boat comes close to that. You kind of forget everything else while you're out there. Hey, it's gonna be tough leaving this place. I just wish Sam would go too. Michonne? She's here! <sighs> I thought we had more time. It's okay. It's gonna be okay. Sam! Just go upstairs with your brother, okay? I need you to hide until I come get you. <sighs> What's gonna happen? He gonna hurt us? Y you'll stop them, right? Right? Just get upstairs. Whatever happens, I'll protect you. Everything will be fine. Stay together, no matter what. We will. Okay. I can get a clear shot of the front gate from upstairs. I'll cover you. If I can. I hope it doesn't come to that. You better not miss. I hope I don't. Paige, if anything goes wrong, I need you to take care of James and Alex. Don't talk like that. Paige, please. Sam, you know I'll... Grab Randall and meet us outside. out there you ready for this anything goes wrong out there I got your back right we just have to be careful not to provoke her I don't want this to turn into a fight hopefully Norma feels that way too It's just me. What the hell is going on here? I had my people hang back a bit. I wanted to talk first. Just us. Clear the air a little. What's your game? No game. I just want to talk. Where's Pete's crew? They're not far. Don't worry. Why should we believe you? I may be a lot of things, but I'm no liar. Your crew is safe, I promise you. Listen, Monroe is gone. Sunk down in the water like everything I built. You and I, we've each taken from the other. All I want now 
is my brother back. That's all. And I'll leave you be. You buying any of this? You'll get Randall after you hand over my friends. After everything you've done, you expect me to simply hand over your friends. Just like that. Careful, Michonne. A show of good faith, then. Any minute now. Safe and sound, just like I said. Now, I want to see my brother. Why the hell are we standing here? We're all homeless because of her. Jenny, stop! They should be dead! That is not what we are here for. Now be quiet! My brother, now. I have given you what you wanted. I just want to see him. You have three of my men. I only have one of yours. Send one of my friends over, and you can have Randall. I think I've been more than reasonable. <laughs> Show me, Randall. <gasps> Oak! Hey, put the gun down. I could shoot him and still have two more to spare. So you're gonna do what I've asked. Now! I came here willing to talk. But if you're gonna insist on being difficult... Don't hurt him, all right? He's right here. Ugh. Randall, you okay? Mm. Hang on, I got you. Now hand him over, and we'll be done with this. Randall isn't worth all this shit. Gabby, listen to After me. After everything they've done, you're still giving them more chances. We deserve retribution. Don't do this! Stop! No! No! <laughs> Virgo! Everyone put your guns uh, down. I knew we couldn't trust them. Don't! Stand down! Please, don't hurt him. If you're not gonna do anything, we have to. That's not your call. Please. We have to even things up somehow. I can make this right. Gabby! Fuck! <laughs> I'll give you that one, all right? We're even. As long as you let Randall go. I'm not gonna ask you again. No one else has to die. Is that a threat? It doesn't need to be. Hand him over. Okay. You can have him. Good. Here we go. Better fucking work. We'll make it work. Randall. Randall, you okay? <laughs> Randall.
road now. Get that gate open. Hurry! Stop her! Yeah. <laughs> 
I'm not gonna hurt you. Every day, I wish I could go back and change it. But I can't. Michelle, it's Dominic. What's Where the hell are you? Go pack your things, okay? We have to go. Where's mommy? We tried to wait. We're, we're, we're heading to Donna. Dad! She'll be fine, come on. No, she'll come look for us. We have to be here. Michelle, if you're still... Stay safe, okay? They need you. I did look for you. I came back. I promise. It was just too late. isn't goodbye. I'll see you again. When? I don't know. Soon. Say goodbye, girls. Your mother has to leave. Please, Mama. Stay here. With us. She can't. Just let her go. Dominic, please. Just let me say goodbye. Come on, Alex! What are you doing? <coughs> no. Girls, enough. Let her leave if that's what she wants. Michelle! No, no, no. Don't go. Colette. She can't stay. We can't stay here! It's too late. Your mother already made up her mind. I wish you could come with me. Michelle! Sorry. Give me your hand. I got 
Sadiq's gonna take a boat down to what's left of Monroe. Salvage what we can. We can drop you off in Oceanside or maybe one of the other communities up north. It's good people. Thanks. And thank you for everything. I don't know if we would have made it out of there without you. You found my brothers. You took care of Norma. We owe you a lot. You didn't need me, Sam. You would have figured it out on your own. <laughs> I'm not sure if that's true, but thanks for saying so. <sighs> It'll be harder out there. Without there too. Might lean on you a bit more. It's not gonna be the same without him. Yeah, I'm gonna miss him too. I know this has been hard on you. In more ways than one. When we got separated, I heard you calling for your daughters. What, what happened in there? I tried to find you. But I couldn't. I had to get everyone out and... I could just hear you screaming. I saw my daughters. I got to talk to them. That, that's not possible, right? For them to be there. I know. Maybe you'd better start thinking about... You know... What if this doesn't go away? Maybe it won't. But this time, when I saw them, I was able to walk away. I couldn't keep living in that moment with them anymore. I think it's time to stop running. Go back to your group, the people you left, your family, before you can to anymore. If I know anything, it's how goddamn impermanent things are these days. Before you know it, they'll be gone. I like being around you guys. It's not goodbye for us. We'll always be around. Come on.
Hey guys, had some problems recording my voice for the audio for this uh, episode, so sorry about that. But anyways, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time, and goodbye.